Hey there, everyone. Welcome back yet again to another episode of Ladder Up, where today we're trying to recover from that close game yesterday where I kind of sucked really hard because I wasn't paying attention. I started recording without having everything set up, so my team preview and my lead was kind of garbage. But I'm going to enjoy another pineapple soda as we run into Grace from California. Ooh. So, from first glance, besides the two fairy types, Yveltal kind of loves this. You got a Giratina, weak, uh, to Yveltal. Kyogre, which gets two shot by foul play. Age of Slash and Gengar don't appreciate Yveltal either. So really his two counters are Mawile and Togekiss. So let's see here. So my system's over here now because of the new setup. I got another monitor. There's a lot, of, a lot less space for me to do this, but it's much better for editing. That's not important. What's important is the fact that I think Thunderous can be good here. Thunderous is very good here. I think Thunderous Javeltal is the way to go. Thunderous Javeltal, Talonflame is probably pretty good, and Mawile. I don't even think we bring Dialga. Honestly, don't even think we need it. Yeah. 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 Of course, keeping in mind that Talonflame doesn't have a fire move on it, which is always great. Not that it matters, though, because he's got uh, Age of Slash and Kyogre. Oh, Mawa and Kyogre, there you go. That's a pretty good lead for him, actually. It's a pretty good lead. Uh, what do I do here? What to do? Wow, that's a good lead. Not sure. Not sure, actually. Um, uh, I do have protect. Okay, I kind of want to get Veltal out of here for later. I think I think he might protect foul play, but if he doesn't, I definitely want to paralyze him. You know, Thunderous should be able to take some kind of special attack. Not, I don't know if it's going to take a Water Spout. I don't remember the counts. Him doubling into uh, Thunderous would be bad. If he protects Mawa, that's great. That was a really good lead on his part. You know, I'm just going to Thunder Wave. He's, he's, he's double attacking. So my Mawa is in a really bad position here. Ice Beam into Thunderous. I can take that. Oh, but if, he, if he's like Iron Heading into Thunderous too, that's really bad. Play Rough into... Okay. That's not the worst. That's not the worst. I'm worried about a Sucker Punch, actually. I'm actually like really worried about a Sucker Punch. Yeah, I'm gonna make this play. If I paralyze this Mawile, that's good for my Mawile. I can Iron Head it. But, so I'm, I'm, think, I'm worried about him thinking, oh, well, I'm just gonna Thunderbolt his Kyogre, so let me Sucker Punch his Thunderous. And I'd rather paralyze it, not take the Sucker Punch damage. And if he does, if he, you know, if he doesn't go for that, then I get to paralyze it anyways. So, I think the odds are better in my favor if half his team is paralyzed. And then I can bring in the Veltal and start just attacking things like crazy. No stab in the back. Talonflame. Not that great. Not that great. So, seeing a Sucker Punch here would be great. Yes. Oh, he... Oh! What? Why? 
He sucker punched my Mawile. That's weird. Okay, that's a very fortunate paralysis. Why did he... That I don't know. I couldn't tell you why that happened. I'll tell you what is going to happen here, though. I'm going to start iron-heading the crap out of his Mawile. Nothing he wants to switch in wants to take either of these attacks. His tiger has gone. Which is great for me. It's really great for me. I got my iron head off, so he's probably going for a play route for an iron head too. That does a lot of damage. He iron heads into my maw wow. Okay, that's fine. I love pineapple soda. It's so good. What do we got here? I think I just bring in your Veltal. What else did he have? Everything else besides the Togekiss was weak to everything, really. Do I want your Veltal or do I want Town Flamin? Don't know. I guess Talonflame. He's sensing Giratina. Okay. The Veltal would have been better. I could quick guard. Kind of just want to brave bird the Giratina. Get some damage on it. Yeah, I'm going to do that. You know what? Actually. Once his whole team is chipped, Veltal can pretty pretty much handle this one by itself. So that, I wish I had done half. Probably Eevee to take three of or take at least two of those. This might take out the Mawile. Okay, I wasn't sure, but I'm glad it did. Glad it did. Shadow Force. Okay, that's good. Now he's locked in. Oh wow. Oh, and it's Age of Slash. Okay, so now, um, like I said, the thing about Shadow Force is it's really powerful, breaks to protect, but, you know, I know, I know exactly what you're doing that turn. Okay, I have an idea. Do I taunt on this? I don't. Okay, here's what I do. I Swagger the Age of Slash, and I Swords Dance. And then if they protect, or they, they King Shield, I get a swagger off. And if they if they King Shield and then um, Shadow Force into Thunderous, I have a uh, a plus two Talon Flame. And I can just destroy this Giratina. So that's not a King Shield. And plus, if this thing hits itself with confusion, it'll take like half its health and damage. And a foul play will knock it out. For sure. Especially if it's actually if it, if it's in shield form, foul play will easily knock it out. Shadow Force into... Okay, now I have... Barring something crazy, I should have a plus two talent time on the field. Come on. Yeah! Look at that! Look how much damage that does. Okay, leftovers. So it might be substitute Age of Slash. The thing is, I've got the, I've got the Giratina pinned down, and I've got the Age of Slash pinned down, because... Since, you know, I think Foul Play is a contact move, so if, if the King Shield and I Foul Play into it, my attack goes down two stages, but Foul Play doesn't, isn't based on my attack, it's based on theirs, and the Age of Slash is at plus two, so I got this. I think they just disconnected. Yeah, they disconnected. Alright, so that's a win for us, guys. I'll take it, yeah. They disconnected for exactly the reasons I just told you, because they knew they couldn't win, because... That end game, though. I mean, Swagger's annoying, but I don't know what they were going for. A Gyro Ball, I don't think, d doesn't take out Talonflame. Shadow Ball might. I really don't know. But Swagger put it put the odds in my favor. So, you know, it was more likely that I was going to get a good turn than they were. So, and that's the problem with Shadow Force, is I only had to really focus on one thing. So, that's going to be it today, guys, for Ladder Up. I hope you enjoyed it. If you like it, 
feel free to like, comment, share, subscribe, all that fun stuff, and hopefully I'll see you back for another episode of Ladder Up.